Hey guys, we're back with a Duelist Great Axe run, and we're at the tail end of this run, starting off in the Hailing Tree. Gotta go do Loretta, then we have Melania, then we gotta finish up the Mountaintops. Not a whole lot left there. And then uh, Fair Missoula and some other random things along the way, including the one I can't wait for, Reichard. Can't wait. Oh, we'll see where we can get in an hour or so. Because Reichard's probably going to be like a, at least a 20 minute fight, if I had to guess. Maybe not, though. It might not be that bad. Oh. Damn it. Good start. <laughs> Weird bit of lag there, too. I don't know what that was. So mean having the crystalline boss there, though. Or that's not a boss, but the enemy. He can shoot you as you're jumping over the thing, and then you just fall to your death. I, mean, I don't really know how much longer we have in the run. It really depends on Melania and Reichard, I'd say. Everything else should be, like, first try, honestly. And pretty quick. This weapon's good against anything that's not fire resistant. And yeah, Melania's just Melania. Stun lock. Incredible stun lock. Incredible. And I, I gotta see what killed me, because I actually... I don't think it was the halberd. I don't know what hit me. That's what shortcuts are for. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to watch that again. Because I didn't see what... what actually finished me off there. I don't think it was the weapon, unless the hit... Well, weapons always have, like, bigger hitboxes than they appear. So it could just be that. But I didn't see any any phalanxes or anything. I don't know. It was weird. I also don't know how she even output that much damage. Because these don't deal that much. Stop moving. That attack sucks, dude. Okay, well, scratch what I said about first trying everything else, apparently. Loretta is a pain with slow weapons. <laughs> Jesus Christ.
Oh, I gotta change my physics too. I change it to the bubble tier just for literally that one part that I was using it at. Because those ants will shred you after you take like insane fall damage and probably kill you or nearly kill you. Surprised she did not stagger there. She better here. Thank you. How is she not dead? Oh, I am so lucky that didn't kill me. That should have probably killed me. Now, let me see my uh, talismans. These are probably fine. I'm thinking maybe we want more defense, but. I can try without. I'll get the uh, defensive flask, I guess. Try that out. The, uh, what I, I don't know what it's called. Whatever negates, like, damage. That one. I'm, I might just pick up the dragon crest. Great shield, talisman, too. Can't hurt that. That could be good for Rikard, honestly. We're gonna have the swaddling cloth, and that's like the only one I know I'm gonna have. Probably stamina regen. I'll have to look at the other ones. No ritual anything. The Swaddling Cloth probably won't even be that effective, but it's probably better than no Swaddling Cloth. But we're not going to proc it that much, unfortunately. Actually, can we go this way? Oh, yeah. Can I make this? Probably, right? Oh, I can go down here. Perfect. Except this doesn't lead me where I want it to. Damn it. Well, I guess we go up here, then. Go through the ballistas. I hate going through the ballistas. And the tree. I don't know when they shoot. Oh, and I forgot about the dude with the great arrow. And the guy with the spear. Wow, this is fun.
then after millennia, it should be, I think it's 16 bosses. You would think I would know by now. But I always tweak the order here and there, and I... I it's either 15 or 16, I'm pretty sure it's 16. Because I added the Misbegotten Crucible after millennia. You know, I can't remember if we did God's Can Do a new game with uh, Flame Art or not. I don't know. I don't remember if I infused it by that point. That'll be interesting to see, because uh, that's gonna not be good. But it's not as ideal as just pure physical. Wow, you were tanky. I don't think it'd be that tanky. Okay, I get it. The hell? Best threads, I guess. What level are we at now? Like 160? 177? Wow, not even close. I have no... No idea why I sent that back up. No reason to. Alright, more decks. One level. Sick. Or actually, hang on. Physic. Oh, I want... This... And, yeah, it's fine. Do it right away, I guess. Duelist vs. Melania. Thousand damage. Bad idea. Oof. Should be able to stagger a lot, which is good. Surprised that didn't stagger her, to be honest. Seventeen hundred. That's unlucky. That's what the defense is for. It's for when you get caught by waterfowl and you can't do anything because you're stuck recovering from an attack. Dude, that range is insane, because I never think that's going to hit me. A final part of that combo, and then somehow it always does. I'd hit her with a stagger. Interesting. What's the point of a colossal weapon if it doesn't stagger? Insane hyper armor. Oh. Probably dead. I tried to <laughs> I tried to do jump art one. <laughs> I couldn't get it in time though. Cause there is there is no way otherwise I was gonna live through that. I was hoping I could get it, but couldn't get it in time. I'm surprised she's not staggering more, honestly.
like fully charged R2 and she's just like, nah. It's so stupid. Yeah, it's unlucky. Fully charged R2, nothing. Just it just damage, no stagger. It's so so disappointing. Alright, well I'm gonna change on playing this then. I think I lost my runes too. Eh, it's alright. We like at this point we really don't need him. Why? Why are you like this, Melania? That's on me, though. I re I should not just do a running attack, knowing when she that she can do Waterfell. Bad play. Okay, I need you to do something, though. Like, you can't just idle the entire time. What is she? She's lit. This is like the most passive I've ever seen her. Now she's not passive, at least. Kind of surprised that reach, to be honest. Okay, she's still being, like, weirdly passive. There's no way I'm getting her there. Too far away. Takes way too long to recover. She, like, every single waterfowl she's done, I, I've been at, like, the... Really? It's like after the recovery of an attack and there's just like literally no way for me to even try and dodge it. Every single one. Great. Can't believe I actually dodged all of those. Stop.
I can't see what she's doing, dude. I <laughs> like I was in mid roll when I realized she was, what she was doing and knew I was gonna get caught. What is happening right now? As a mess. I can't believe that last attack hit me too. But like, I, I couldn't see what she was doing when she did the grab. So I rolled away from her because I, you know, she wanted to create some space. And like, as I was mid roll, she goes for the grab. And I couldn't get away. She caught me. Why are you recovering that quickly? What the hell, dude? Jesus Christ. This fight is cursed. Please, thank you. That was almost really bad. One more hit, come on. I'll take it. What? She's, that's like the end of a combo that <laughs> so weird. It's like I interrupted her combo and then she just kept doing it after, uh... Like there, too! What? What is this? I didn't... I've never seen her do that. <laughs> she did it twice in a row. Please don't grab me now. See, that's what I was that's what was supposed to happen last time when she she was supposed to stagger. And I don't think she did. God, it's too slow, man. There's not enough time to like start running in like quickly or whatever. Not like I'd like to anyway. Ooh. That must hurt, right? She went right into that. The mark of a true lord. Alright, let's get out of here. We're going to here. God skin, god skin and snail. Yeah, the it, it's very 
hard, like, if you're, like, right after an attack, uh, and she does Waterfowl, because you just don't have enough time to recover to start running around her. With these things. I assume any colossal weapon, really. You know, I don't actually know where we should stop Dex and maybe pivot back to Arcade, or if that even makes any sense at all. But I, it doesn't really matter, honestly, at this point. I don't think we're really getting much damage from more Dex. I don't think we were really getting much in the first place. But I gotta put him somewhere. Why are you hopping away? Trying to jump over him and then he jumps backwards. Do something? Something else maybe? Not that. I don't like any of your attacks, sir. Except for that one, actually. That one's good. All the other ones kind of suck. That one's okay if you, like, see it coming, because you want to roll to his left. Can I, wait, is my roll button broken? Like, I... I hit it twice and dodged neither attack. Oh, you're already I forget he, he like goes to phase two if you snagger him during the transition. Anyway. Wow. So many times, like bosses have just had one HP. On this runner, like they've been like, you know, a sliver away from death. I don't think it's happened more in any one run than this one. Two staggers, sick. Don't. Okay, I thought he was gonna belly bump. And then hopefully, uh, Borealis won't be too bad, because fire, I think, is good. And you know what? I think, I don't remember what. I think it was the, was it the Banshee Knight's Halberd? I think I tested to see if... Oh, I didn't want to go here. That's fine. I think I tested to see if uh, the, the snail summons godskins again. 
what I didn't do is uh, try and lower his health to see if maybe there's like a damage threshold where he summons the Godskins, because I think he does. He was like squirming at the end there after that first hit. I wonder if he was like trying to summon them or something. I don't know though. Something to test another time. Oh, I didn't know what he was... Okay. I thought... Like, like I can't see anything, so... It's kind of just going off sound, and apparently he was not doing what I thought he was. I have no clue what's happening right now. Okay, I think the fire damage is going to carry here, because I'm pretty sure slash damage is... Almost non existent. Some headshots. Don't hit the stump. Thank you. Sweet. No AoE. Uh, let's get the sacred tier. Why not? Then we got Vike. I think if we get through, like, Placidus Axe at this part, then we should be able to finish next time. Hopefully, uh, Rankard will be not too awful, but we'll see. I think the Phase 1 of Rankard has half the health of Phase 2 or something like that. I think altogether they had, like, 112k HP. It's a lot. I thought it was 150, but 150 is uh, New Game plus 7. Alright, this guy. I hate fighting bike. That's the wrong thing. Oh, I have Endure, though. That could be good. Oh, if I can stagger him out of that every time, I'd be a happy man. Of course, I have to hit him to do that. Only holds that for a while, huh? I hate this NPC. Hate him. Not as bad as Gideon, though. But still pretty annoying. What the hell? He's just not moving.
Dude, and, and the worst part is you can't backstab him because he turns. It's like anti-backstab. Think and will let me poise through that. Can you jump this? Maybe you can. All right, two more bosses, and then Fair Missoula. How are we doing on time? 11.31. I'm trying to remember how long. I think I farmed for 40 minutes. This has been, like, a pretty fast run, honestly. Even though this uh, last 40 minutes has been not the best. And if Rykard wasn't going to be like a slog, this could uh, be up there for one of the fastest runs. I think the Banished Knight's Halberd is still the fastest than the Uchi after that. But it's pretty impressive considering there's no bleed on this thing. And we had to do like four magma worms who were all resistant to it. And Moog. Still have another Moog, which is also resistant. So, I don't know if we'll finish under 13, but that would be nice. Because that'd be like a 1220 minus the farm time, which is like 20 minutes off the Uchi run. Where? Oh, here. Oh, this, it didn't look right for some reason. This path, I don't know why. But, like, outside of Rekord, everything else looks pretty easy. I mean, it's just the sewer bosses, the final three who we've already fought with this thing. Malakath, Fortis Axe. So we got Placidus Axe, Godskin Duo. I don't know why I'm waiting for that to come up, because we're not going back up that. Pretty much the same, but I think we're gonna go physical because it's gonna help us more, even though it's like really not much more <laughs> like two points of damage, two AR.
This is the real boss. Don't let the lack of a health bar fool you. Come on, I don't have all day, buddy. Don't you do what the other guy does. Usually the troll does not leave like the other uh, dungeon that has this, the other hero's grave. Sainted hero's grave. Iframes? Why do you get iframes? Why are you so special? Okay, I get, I get it. Stop. He's not stopping. Dude, that's so unlucky. <laughs> he just kept stopping. I can hit him. Because his R1 is stupid. Oh my god. Like, I hate the rolling R1 on this thing. I hate it. Um, is this... I think this is down, right? I think we're good. I'm surprised he wasn't dead either, because I think he was missing a little bit of health. Again. Ancient hero. Second to last dungeon. Nice fancy spin, but you're dead. All right, uh, I was gonna say giant lord. That's not right. Fire giant. Hmm. I wonder if this is one of those ones where we should do Rikar and like. Not last, but maybe we do Malekith, sewer bosses, and then do Rikard. I guess it doesn't really matter. There's no reason to change it or not change it. Well, actually, I guess it technically would be better to do him, like, closer to the end, because we could still get more decks, but it's fine. I'll probably just do him when I normally do him. We'll do it right before Malkath.
Could do now, too. Well, not right now. Could have done it before uh, Fire Giant. I rolled so early. How's this not broken? Too, baby, let's go. Sure, I could hit that. All right, come on. I really never noticed like any fire resistance on giant, giant lord. I believe I keep saying giant lord, fire giant. Oddly, like I don't know how. Such a weird spot there. Oh, this attack that I like almost never see. I didn't even know what he was doing. This is what I thought he was doing. And then he just did something completely different. I think what it is is fire giants just normally like super tanky so like it doesn't really feel like this is worse than like anything else and as I just keep missing so many hits too Oops. that's not helping
Then we go right into another long one with Godskin Duo. Oof. On the plus side, the stackers should help out a ton, hopefully, with this fight. Assuming I can get them. And not die in the process. Time to burn this sucker. Eyes well and death. Are you to commit? I am ready. Very well. Let my hand. Oh, controller. So I think Gods Can Do is like the only other boss I'm like slightly worried about. And honestly, it probably won't be that bad. But it's just Rikard, really. Dying to Rikard will cost so much time. Depending on when you die, I guess. If you die like at the end of the fight or something, then it will cost a lot of time. Also, I don't know how the poise situation is going to be with uh, this armor set in the lava, but we'll see on that. Always lags in here, like right around here, right there, every time. I don't know what it is. I don't know why it lags. But every time I come through Fair Missoula, it's in that I, pretty much that spot. I think it would have been pretty cool to see Fair Missoula before it like got all destroyed. And I wonder if it was always in the sky. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that dude. <laughs> I didn't even see him. Good first hit. 
now we never get another hit again, because he just doesn't give me an opportunity. I mean, 681's not that bad. He's almost dead, though. No, please, come on. Go! Ugh. Really? Damn, man. I can't believe he didn't stagger. I, 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 I can't see. Oof. Don't go forward! Wow, he's still rolling. I figured he would have been done. That's unfortunate. Also unfortunate. Like, I just can never get the last attack I need to do anything here. Get staggers to pitch them off. He's gonna go into phase two. Never mind, he's gonna summon. Citizax, the plus Citizax, here we come. It shouldn't be too bad. Hopefully, that wasn't too bad either. Gods can do well. So what do we have? We have Placidasax, Fortisax, It's Beyond Crucible, and Right Card. Then we finish Malekith, do the two sewer bosses in the final three, and that's a run in the books. 32nd run? I can't remember what run of this, or what run of Elden Ring this is. A lot more to come, though. I think in my current base, if I was to, and I'm not going to, but if I was to do this for like 40 hours a week, just Elden Ring, it would still take me like 
two and a half years to finish. Although I think that pace would improve. But, uh, I don't know. Some runs are longer. Some runs are, are shorter. I think the average time of, like, a normal melee run is definitely coming down. But, again, we also don't have DLC yet. There's also more DLC weapons. Like, it's actually crazy how short the other games look in comparison. Bloodborne and Demon Souls would probably be a couple hundred hours each. Dark Souls 1, I think, would be under a thousand. And 2 and 3 are probably over a thousand. 2 is definitely over a thousand. 2 is probably like 2,000. And uh, 3 is over a thousand. Bloodborne is, like I said, not, not that long. But Elden Ring is just a behemoth compared to these games in terms of content. Or the other games, I should say. into the storm. He might be a little fire resistant, I don't really know. I feel like he's probably resistant to everything. I can't run though, and I missed. I'll take that. Up we go. That's close. A couple attacks that I, like, so infrequently see. Nice, another stagger. Thank you, Colossal Weapons. Not gonna miss this one. It's not super angry yet. Getting there, though. The hell? <laughs> Why did that fall? I'm gonna somehow fail to dodge this. Oh. I'm usually like awful at dodging that because the hitbox is just so weird.
Oh, I can't, I can't see. Which way is he facing the other way? Okay. Dangerous. Beautiful. I love how you just teleport through the head. It's my favorite thing to do. <laughs> Two Fortisex. I knew you. What is it to you to deny a like the dogma? You I am the they call yet you old me. Okay, this is gonna look interesting. <laughs> Helmet's skilling through her head. Have you ever seen a when the first god wins? But there is and I'm before the time. When at another and I'm before the time. My hand will you still? This? How did you? Oh my. With this and clay you um and though I can't. Can I hold? I and it the new lies the room. Please brandish the stay that I become. This helmet just <laughs> it's not even it's the cloak i think really that makes the helmet look so much bigger because it's uh it's on top of all the snake uh models on the helmet so it makes it look massive i would go more decks i guess Nope. I don't want to talk again, just once. So. Oh, why? Okay, stop. <laughs> Downside of just mashing X. Alright, we're gonna call it here, actually. We'll pick up with Fortis X next time and then finish the rest of the game. Thanks for watching, guys.